the total revenue is showing here 400 to four something. This is an account called on Chowipa store GFO account. And uh, I'll go to another account. It's called FinFed uh, GFO account. This is another website account. And you can see the total revenue option uh, doesn't show up uh, uh, here. So I will compare between two GFO accounts, this account and this account, and uh, I will fix the problem. Why didn't uh, show up the total revenue here? Although, uh, although um, we sold uh, a few product from our website, uh, if I click on the event option, you will see the purchase purchase event you can see the purchase event we sold uh, seven products from our website but the total revenue uh, didn't show up uh, in google analytics account so what is the main problem do you, uh, after after uh, watching this video you will be able to solve the problem and this is very easy method and uh, simple and easy map order that I think. And first of all, first of all, uh, you should uh, set up all event uh, parameter according to GFO instruction. You must be needed uh, to send uh, to send uh, event parameter in GFO like uh, transaction ID, value, currency, and item name. Okay, so uh, this is. A Google Tag Manager account, and here is another Google Tag Manager account. So uh, I will click the purchase tag. You can see the tag option, and I will click the purchase tag, and also I will click this uh, purchase 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 tag, and I will compare uh, two accounts. And where is the main problem? I will find out okay so you can see the purchase uh, purchase event here purchase event and uh, you can see all parameter and need uh, transaction id total value currency and item name and this is another account you can see say everything is same here and uh, transaction id total value and currency and uh, item name, but this this uh, GTM account includes uh, uh, under this uh, GFO account. But uh, what is the problem? After set up all the event parameter, you can see here is an option more settings, more settings, and here is e-commerce option. You can see send e-commerce data. This option is check mark here, and I click on the another tag manager account. And if I click the more settings, and you can see the send e-commerce data is unchecked. Okay, so this is the main problem. This is the main problem, and well, that's why the total revenue option and uh, didn't show up here. So if I click this option and i click on the save option then the the all total revenue will show up in this gfo account so this is the main problem this is the main problem and uh, after clicking this option you will be able to solve your account uh, problem and your all revenue will be show off in your GFO account. Okay, after save, after save your check, click the submit option, click the publish, and click the continue option. And uh, your all data will be show off on your, uh, in your GFO account after, after 12 hours or 24 hours or 48 hours. If someone purchase your product from your website, then all revenue will be shut out. So uh, I hope this video is helpful for you.
if you think this video is helpful for you then like the video and to subscribe the channel and comment down below uh, did you solve the problem or not otherwise uh, I, will, uh, I will make another tutorial for